Well, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Let's talk about the reality. Let's talk about the reality that's gonna hit you once you're here. Let's talk about the reality. आने के बाद में होएगा क्या आपके दिमाग में चलेगा क्या आपके दिमाग में The moment you get into your flight. to wherever you flying to abroad for your studies with your dreams you know head held high jo kuch bhi hoga matlab dimag mein ye chalega ki you'll have that thrill of a feeling when you're in the flight that you you're going to go chase your dreams you're going to uh probably do the job of your life in uh, two years after your masters you know do your part time get a car send back home money a lot of things will actually keep running in your mind land hone ke baad mein probably you'll be waiting for people coming for you to pick you up uh, your friends everything will be so dreamy dreamy for you that you'll land it you'll post on instagram you're doing this you're doing that i'm talking about most of the people like majority of the people what's going to actually happen and then once you land uh you'll be back home uh talking to your friends that this is happening that is happening uh you might be emotional calling everybody that you're here every it's this that later after like 3 or 4 days the reality hits you and you'll be like what's happening like fuck where am i like what's happening with me actually shit i've put like 20000 pounds or like 15000 pounds for this covers for two years i'm really going to chase it i'm really going to do it like what's actually happening you re- you really won't understand anything for a minute but don't feel homesick about it uh don't feel bad that you miss your parents uh, or you're not going to achieve what you actually have in your mind before you are actually coming here just think about that nobody forced you to come here it was your bloody decision to make it was your own thing that you wanted to achieve your dreams you wanted to set few limits in your family that you are the ice breaker of your family you will be the torch bearer of your family trust me everybody has this in their mind everybody uh, who's coming here or like at least at least majority of the people if not everybody will be looking at a point where i'm going to go, go to such great heights that maybe none of my family members ever have achieved you guys might have obviously be feeling something like this trust me if you are emotionally strong mentally strong that uh, maybe you can do anything to achieve that height your discipline your uh, mentality your approach to life your approach to doing things your process of uh, you know getting a product in the end i meant uh, probably you're doing some work and end of the day you want the result that that is the product i'm talking about and uh, things like that it does matter you have to be very focused when you're here uh, maybe once in a while you go party you do stuff but choose your circle wisely once you come here choose the things you're going to do wisely it's not going to be easy uh don't trust people simply when you're here uh don't rush into new friendships that's the major point do not rush into f- good friendships or that do not to be desperate to make friends let it go slow don't mind if you're alone if you're alone focus on things that actually has to be done before your uni starts probably collecting your brp doing your uh, national insurance number uh, getting up new bank account you you've got a lot of things to do actually you know knowing your atmosphere around you you know what's actually around the place you're living uh, knowing your uni knowing your ca- classes uh, probably read out your uh, modules you actually have you've got a lot of things to do if you really want to be prepared for what's actually coming in front for you so it's not going to be easy right what all you could basically do is let everything calm down you settle down first you know what's actually happening around you get it i'm not motivating you guys and i don't think in this whatever i'm saying is kind of motivating but uh, whatever i say is 
the decisions you've made you have to live by it don't go back you might feel lonely you might feel alone but it's all okay because you're not in your comfort zone anymore you've come out of your comfort zone so it is going to feel like that probably it may take a week or two or a month at max but i am as young as you guys i'm 21 years old and i've come here to probably do good in my sport and i also study as well and i'm also going to work so you just plan your day schedule out what's actually working for you or not do not encourage your uh, false friendships you do not get into lot of funky stuff or i'd say lot of fun fun stuff don't get into those things it's good for you if you actually stay away because you're abroad and this place is actually expensive trust me there is expensive you'll know it the day you land here you'll be like for a single bottle of water for a 500 ml of water you'll be paying 1 pound or something and you'll realize the calculation amount what the hell 100 rupees am i paying for a water bottle you people might have been hesitant that you have to clean your own dishes you have to do your laundry you have to do your food you have to clean up everything all the mess and maybe ghar pe you might be the raja you might be the king sitting on the couch ordering mom to do this do that and they'll do that because that's your home here nobody is there for you you've got to do every single thing on your own and that's not easy at all it's it, it is easy i mean life is not hard here man if you're working if you get a part time and if you're a student you're just going to go to the university 3 days a week at max or 4 days a week max if you're going 4 days a week probably 3 or 4 hours or like 5 hours at max per day your university going to be there or if you're going for 2 days probably it might be for like 7 hours or 5 hours at max so it's not a burden you can do your part time and earn what like 6 to 800 or if you uh, if you're in really luck above 800 or something for working 20 hours so 600 to 800 pounds a month will actually cover your monthly expenses at least 95 or 90% or like what 4500 500 or 600 for a, a room and probably 100 pounds you can cover your monthly food bills but don't sit calm back in home if you guys are back home try to do something productive if you don't know what to do productive go to chat gpt type in all your interests detail it about it every single thing what you want to do how you are you everything and that will share responses on based on your behavior and stuff i mean you don't even have to go to chat gpt man you just you can simply figure out yourself what you are really interested in and do that in your free time most of the students may be working 20 hours a week doing let's say uh 15 hours of you know a sleep a week you still have a lot of time left before you sleep i i know most of you guys not going to sleep 8 hours a day so you guys have lot left to do in your days so what you can do is probably figure out some art you want to do figure out some uh physical activity you want to do uh, apart from that probably do a sport probably learn a new uh creative uh tool in your uh you know software or something like that there's hell lot of things to do man i i list out for you guys I'll drop a short reel uh, upcoming after this uh, you know what you guys can actually do once you actually come here what all things you have uh, to be done immediately you drop out drop i mean drop down here in the uk that's it i hope you guys find this at least a bit informative hopefully and If you guys have anything you want to talk about, if you feel lonely, you can drop down a text for me on Instagram. You can see it rolling out here, and <clears throat> I'm there for you guys. If you want to talk about anything emotionally or you want, you feel homesick, you can just text me because you don't have to go back or uh, feel lonely. You just need to be around good people. Choose your people because that is what is gonna make huge change in your life. here once you come here choose your circle wisely your the circle you actually choose is going to determine what you are actually going to be in the future don't mess around much with friends and fun try to figure out good ways to develop because this is the land of opportunities that you thought and flew here so that's it you just got to be right uh sometimes have fun but it's okay but try to be creative productive and disciplined that's gonna for sure take your head uh, i'm not advising or doing some recommendation i'm just speaking words that actually make sense and i am still very young like you guys 21 years old so something like that so peace out guys have a good day have a good evening have a good morning whatever it is for you and uh, make sure you 
ट्रीट यू सेल्फ वेल एंड कीप स्माइलिंग एंड मेक यू पेरेंट्स प्राउड दैट्स वॉट वी हियर फॉर इन दी एंड ऑफ द डे फॉर अर्निंग मनी और लाइक चेंजिंग समथिंग फॉर आर सेल्स एंड फैमिलीज आई होप यू गाइज फाउंड दिस वेल एनाफ to actually give a thought of what you guys are running in your minds see you